Hello, so welcome back to my shed. i um, going to get on with this today, hopefully get it finished. I've just got a little bit of tidying up to do, as you can see. Um, yeah, that's another video for another day. Uh, yeah, so let's get on with it. Right, so for ease, I've just literally stuck the mechanism in there, put some screws either side just to hold it, and I'm going to put a hole now through here with something to go in and out for the power. I think that'll be the easiest option. I'm gonna put the battery, I think. I can make these bigger, so that's not a problem. Probably up here at the very top that you can't see. So let's get on with making this first work. And we'll go from there. But let's try and keep it simple, not overcomplicate things. Right, so I've got these junk boxes that I call it, that I just keep random stuff. And we'll see if I've got, what are these? God knows. See what I've got to do the job. Ah, we'll have that. And that. Pretty cool. And even this, I think this is an old cheese thing. Stab it, push it off. Never seen one before. More junk. What I've done for now, <clears throat> these bits are not big enough. So I'll get rid of them. I'm going to weld just a flat bar here. Nice and crude, but it work. And I've smashed that in and glued it as a bit of a pressure switch i'm going to cut this down to size but let's see if it works so hang on while i'll get you in the, touch the battery if i spin this gently we should voila done was heated the old one pulled it out and cut a new one and heated it and pushed it in and it's a bigger so let's see if that works so they getting a welder and all that out perfect all right switches These are the switches I've collected. Some of them are not switches, I know. But we're gonna need one for the light, which I like that one, I think that's pretty good. Probably gonna use that, yeah, that's fine. Five amp, more than enough for that light. So probably put this for this light here. Now we're gonna need a beefier one. I don't know about these and what amperages they are. Three amp, two amp for 250, four amp, 125 volt. Don't think they're gonna be beefy enough. That's 10 amp. I might choose that, see how that, if it burns out, no big deal. Right, <clears throat> so, just notched a hole out of there. Got a piece of metal. Put the switches in. And I'll screw that down. It's probably on and off. Light on, light off. And then, I'm gonna wire it all up. Right, there we go. So far, so good. So I've put a, um, a scrap back battery hold a bit on cut it just sprayed it it's all good it works i've got the live coming off broken by this switch um don't know if this switch is gonna peak at 40 amps and burn out 
but I'm not running it anywhere near 40 amps, I don't think. Um, you'd be lethal to run it at that RPM mm. on that. Um, the LED light decided to break, so I haven't got one now, but that could be for the future, so I'm going to leave that switch there. Inside, it's a little bit messy, but again, it's a prototype. I've put extra wiring length because I wanted to, I can always cut it, I can't add it once it's in there. But this mechanism here works quite quite good. So we'll give it a little test. So this is your speed. Here's your battery. Let's plug the battery in. Turn it on. Twist this until it starts to make contact. There we go. So this is a good speed. Works nicely. You probably don't want to go any faster than this, really, anyway. So I think this switch is going to be absolutely fine for, for short periods of time. Can it go faster? Yeah, so basically, um, it's it's a fun project. Sorry it's taking so long. I've just got young children and the house and a full-time job. So yeah, when I get a bit more time, I can spend more time on it. I'm only getting about an hour every, time, every weekend, if possible, to do it. But um, I've got a good video coming up about a wood turning shop. That was pretty good. I went with my dad um, just to see about them and looking into getting a, a proper one. But yeah, that was quite fun. So I'm going to upload that video today as well if I get a chance. But yeah, this is coming along good. Don't know if it's going to work. Um, it, the idea is there. It's working at the moment. It's a shame about the LED, but I'm sure I can put something in the future. So stay tuned, like, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next video.